So beautiful Cancerian, you need to trust the process and believe that you are meant for this person. You're meant to roll with them, you're meant to ride with them, you're meant to be a part of their life, you're meant to grow with them. You're meant to like Bonnie and Clyde, you're meant to be a part of this person's life you're meant to be a part of their life wherever they go whatever they're doing you're meant to be beside them with them you need to trust and believe that you're meant to like you're a part of this person's life you're meant to be together you're meant to be with this person i feel like you don't trust it you're questioning it you're ifing you're doubting you know, you're wondering if you fit in. You need to know that you fit in. You fit into this person's life. You're meant to be there. You fit in with the tribe. You're their soul tribe, their soul family. You and them like the same things. You chase after the same dreams. You need to, you aspire for the same things. Maybe when it comes to children and family, you need to know that this person, you and them, you are like them. You don't have to be afraid to know that you are meant to be with this person. You're meant to be in their life. Um, this is like, this is someone that is meant to be a part of your life. How can I say cancer? And it feels like, imagine I'm seeing this girl. She's hesitant about rolling with the tribe. She's hesitant about like running in the wild with what these people like are calling her like telling her like yeah this is this is your natural this is your original state you're meant to be with us you know what i'm saying you're meant to roll with us you're part of our tribe but at first she wondered would she really fit in is she gonna fit in can she really be a part of this clan can she our tribe can she roll with this person can she really be a part of his life can she fit in can she keep up with him is she meant to do the things that he's doing or she's doing you know what i'm saying some feel like yeah you are meant you need to trust and believe that you are a part of this person's soul family soul tribe bikes and sounds like that may be important wow oh my gosh i feel like you are meant <laughs> i really do feel like you are meant to be together you're meant for this life you're gonna step into the role and fulfill it you're gonna find that you love the lifestyle you love being yourself you love rolling with this person you know you're, they're not asking too much of you and you're not forcing yourself to fit in this is this is you you know passion energy here passion and instincts oh my god this is you this is fulfilling this is your destiny this is where you're supposed to be this is where you're meant to be in this person's life and believe you me cancer and this person knows that but i feel like this person is like patiently standing there waiting for you to claim the space beside them and fulfill your role and fulfill your destiny as part of their life all right this person i feel like they're never gonna leave you yeah isolation i'm telling you this person is standing there they're way they choose you this person choose you they know you're the one and they know this person knows that when you fulfill your role like i said you will light up in it you'll be lighting up in it you'll thrill in it you'll delight in living so close to home and so close to your natural self and your beautiful self and the just the life that you're meant to be living and pursuing. This person knows that you're going to look alive in it. You know what I'm saying? This person knows that about you. They know that. All right. Um, so, yeah, I'm seeing that this person is waiting. Look, soulmate. I'm telling you, the soulmate card, you beautiful soul. This person knows. There's This person is also very beautiful. Inside and out. This person knows that you are their soulmate. And this person is waiting this person is already sure that they want to run with you, ride with you, live life with you. All right, this person may be very exciting. They like outdoors. They love adventure. They love the wild. They love the wind. This person could be air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a moon sign, Pisces. 
something about the wolves the, the soul number three may be significant and the soul of this person's feet is how they trust in you how they trust in the feeling the sense of awareness that you are a meant that like this person knows you they can feel the sense of who you are through their soul like imagine this person recognizes your soul spirit by the soul of their feet which is the soul of their eyes which is their soul this person recognize you through their prowl their prowess through how they feel this person knows and can tell that you are one of them you are meant to be in their tribe in their life this is the life that's meant for you this person knows that that is why they're standing here thinking about you and you may have gone out with this person before this person's not forgotten about you all right waiting for you to come around this person can't wait recovery look waiting for you to come around recovery is the next card this person cannot wait this person is happily anticipating when you when you decide to be true to yourself to roll with them you know what i'm saying saying because they know that you're gonna live such a beautiful life together it's just you especially you and them they know that you and them together oh man like it's gonna be a ride we're gonna do so much things together this is how this person is feeling like they can't wait this person can't wait to be with you all right this is someone you've met before someone you've known when you when you were young for some of you this is some one of you or both of you may currently be with someone and or you have um options and you need to really choose to walk away or close some doors from certain past connections so that you are you and this soulmate person of your like deep soul connection can really move for, forward together you know because that is what is meant to happen recovery so someone coming back it feels like and um yeah and i feel like it's gonna be good yeah i feel like with this despondence card for a longer time people have just chosen not to go with the flow not to be true to themselves not to run and chase their dreams not to be in their true spiritual calling and their true spiritual soulmate instinctual um connection you know they've faltered they've decided to just go with the norm or go with what they're used to because uh maybe taking a risk or a leap of faith seems too much to believe that this is true when that is all you want to do when that is all you want to do is go be with this person you know but i'm feeling like this person is waiting for you yeah guilt i'm feeling cancer and that that is this is all someone wants to do is be with you but they feel like they're stuck waiting for something to change or waiting for themselves to be better or waiting to get over something or someone this person is just always thinking about you or this is someone that you're always thinking about you know that you're meant to be with this person but then you're stuck in a particular lifestyle you're stuck in the house for example and you, you know you need to break out and go run wild and run free and be with the person of your longing right but you're maybe remaining committed to something someone perhaps your prayer mm-hmm it feels to me like you've been asking for this person and God sent them to you. Your prayer was answered. But then when you saw this person, you I feel like you felt like you had other commitments. You couldn't commit to this person. You couldn't, even though this person felt like your muse, even though they felt like they were, that you've known them from a different lifetime before, or you know you have some connection with this person. It's like you ran away, you told them no. It's like your story, you you manifested this person with that prayer card. 
because this is reminding me of a woman who stays inside her house a lot and um she reads books or she's a writer and she brings one of her characters to life one of her male characters to life and one day she runs out to the bookstore and she ends up meeting him but she can't believe that he's actually here for real and so she ran away from him and went back home and locked the door but he's made for her because she brought him to life so he's of course going to pursue her because he's here for her but she doesn't believe it herself so it's like I feel an energy where you prayed for something and God answered your prayers but then you're like what <laughs> you're like i wasn't ready i wasn't ready for that what are you doing but this person is already here so what are you gonna do quest yeah you've got to answer and because you've got your answer some of you you've got your answer some of you can say and you wanted to know if this person was the one for you for true and the answer is yes soulmate like this person is here to like make your dreams come true or grow with you be with you expand with you um expand your world with you or something like that something about deep diving mysticism but if it's like if you never try you will never know but i do feel like this life this is meant for you beautiful soul so thanks for tuning in and i'll see you in the next one all is well all is within you. Uh, much love. Thanks for liking this reading, sharing the messages with those you love, subscribing to the channel, and leaving your beautiful comments. I'll see you next time.